Hello, I have another devlog for you. Uh, I've done like a whole bunch of work on sort of like profiling and optimizing things because things are kind of starting to work together. Uh, but there were some like facing issues, so I had to like rework some of the mechanisms. Uh, one of it is uh, the build is no longer using the TCP client for actual like sending data. It's still JSON under the hood, which I'm also going to be replacing uh, maybe soonish. Uh, but it is using the shared memory buffer with system level um, with system level semaphores. Uh, the queue was also split in two because uh, there's like one that's like handling a lot of the asset processing and asset messages, and it was actually causing issues with frame pacing. And I hit it back. Um, one thing is that the builds are a little bit less stable because it actually runs faster. <laughs> um, so they kind of hit a bug that like uh, just freezes it. Uh, I need to look into that, but I just wanted to give you a big like quick showcase because I've run into a few worlds and it's starting to feel pretty good. Uh, so like I said, like it's split into two. That helps a little bit of frame pacing. I did like a bunch of like other optimizations. There's still more optimizations to do, but now like it's actually starting to run pretty like decently most of the time. Um, so how is like stuff stacks exploding so let me actually open this again uh i'm gonna open i'm the world I actually ran through a few worlds like right before this there's also like a new sort of like facing information as well um uh, how long like stuff takes this one i kind of need to like tune a bit uh yeah um the time makes them to be like pretty low that is like a significantly lower but it also kind of like hard performs under load, but it's a little bit harder to test still because it kind of explodes. Let me do some loading. So I'm going to just open Virgin Islands, for example. Let's load it up. Um, I will need to do some of the tuning and also loading, but like it's pretty quick. Like it, it's pretty much almost instant. Almost. Um... I thought it might like be the trader of a little bit to be like smoother, but this is like feeling pretty good. Um, and yeah, like I was saying, the queue was split into the two that helped like a fair bit with frame pacing. Um, there's still more things I want to like do, uh, but it's starting to get like where it's now on my machine, it's like exceeding the frame rate I cannot get like with the other things. Also, like. Um, since I do like simple tests like this, uh, I think there's like a fair bit like where um, there's a good amount that's like GPU bound with like how much stuff is like being rendered and it's gonna be interesting to see how it scales, uh, how it scales like you know with like lots of people in the world. Uh, let's do a shoot code, it was also interesting, oh, I don't think this right should Cove. Uh, I don't know why it's showing this account. Showing that and load it up. I hope it doesn't explode. There we go. And load it in. There's like one thing. Oh, and there we go. Died again. Uh, there's like a bug with. Um, there's a bug with like the ambient light that seems to like freak out. Uh I'm gonna try one more time, let's try a few different things. Uh and there's actually like, you know, it, it it was there in the previous builds as well, but I think now because the pacing is faster, um it's easier to like and oh also I don't think I mentioned, like uh now I also have like implanted proper loops, so it's no longer like Cap to like 60 FPS, um, or like under 60 FPS, uh, because it was like using the headless loop, and now it actually has its own dedicated uh, graphics client loop. I think it's actually the, the recording is also making it worse because uh, it kind of fluctuates. Um, what else could we try? Let's look at some of the MMC worlds. Oh, no, it could be a good test. I kind of want to something with like a lot of moving stuff. Um, actually, you know what? Let's uh, let's try the Cloudscape Harvest. But let's play this Cloudscape Harvest. Let's try loading that up. It's the one like where my cursor became carrots, which I still haven't addressed. I was kind of focusing on more pacing thing because, um, 
I wanted to make sure that is tuned, or at least like do part of the tuning before proceeding more. There we go. Load it in. Um, also, oh, and it dies. Yeah, you see, like the builds are. Um, it's kind of funny once it kind of starts running faster, like it just runs into something that makes it explode like much quicker. But um, you see, kind of what state it is in. It's feeling pretty good, like on desktop right now. Um, is like pretty smooth and responsive. You probably can't tell in a video, but I have like a high refresh rate screen and it like feels nice, like quite responsive. Um, I might give things one more try. Uh, let's try one more time. It's also nice to start up as fast. <laughs> it's like, um, I might also smooth out this one, but it's like where it's still like loading all the stuff, like it kind of like hitches a bit like on the logo. Um, and I'm considering that like, uh, actually let's do the Cloud Home. Cloud Home might be a good one. Cloud Home, let's open it up. I'm gonna do features. I'm gonna open the default one. It's loading up. Hopefully it doesn't explode during the loading, so I can show at least a little bit. Oh, it's downloading stuff. There we go. Loading in, and we're in. Stop slipping pretty okay. Uh, I'm gonna try... Oh! And there we go. Yeah, it has it like super fast right now because it's kind of, you know, just running. It's kind of funny because like sometimes when it's kind of like limited how it runs, like some of the stuff like race conditions and so you don't really hate as much, but like once you start running really fast, it just freaks out. So I think I'm going to end it here because like, you know, you see like I, I'm at a state where I need to look into other things, those bugs again. Um, it's also no longer making like giant blocks. Uh, some of the pacing was diagnosing as well. And uh what is going on? Oh, the blocks like tons of errors after it dies. Uh but usually it was the invalid result on the So it's already gone. Oh. That is something different, I think. Is this Oh, we no wait, it might have died on the other end. I'll have to poke around these. Um, but yeah, thank you very much for watching, and I'll have more progress soon. But uh, still needs more work before it's like ready to test it because it doesn't, it has bugs, you know, that become very, very quickly obvious. Um, once it's able to like run for relatively stably, like this, probably like when I'll feel it's ready for more public testing. But thank you very much, and see you in the next video.